No matter how cliche it is, the end of every year is a time for reflection. Looking back at what's behind you and considering what lies ahead. Acknowledging your successes and noting the things that still need work. For me, this new year is a perfect excuse to consider my goals moving forward and set myself up to work on achieving them. This year, my focus is accountability. There are a lot of milestones I'm hoping to achieve this year, both with my art and with my personal life, and I need to be ready to be aggressive and disciplined in my pursuit. To get myself off on the right foot, I decided to take the time to refresh my studio space and set up my planners for the new year. I began on New Year's Eve going through all of my supplies. I purged out old stuff that I could no longer use and reorganized everything that I had left. Starting with my closet, then moving on to my drawer set. I neatened up my shelves next and then worked on my desk drawers. I tried to keep things organized by general category and make sure that I have easy access to the supplies that I use the most. I cleaned off my desk, gave it a good wipe down, and set my tools up to start planning for the next day. New Year's morning, I allowed myself a leisurely start, had a nice breakfast, and then sat down to begin. I love to start the year with a fresh notebook and planner, and this year I got a new sketchbook as well. My sketchbook and my notebook are both 5 by 8 and 1 quarter soft cover books by Moleskin. My sketchbook has simple blank pages, and my notebook is in dot grid. I'm pretty loyal to Moleskin products. I love the quality and the cream color of their pages, and their soft cover binding is my favorite. I've tried different, less expensive options, but I keep coming back to this brand. I keep the notebook with me at all times, and I use it to plan out my month and for journaling. I began my 2019 notebook with a personal affirmation message for myself, expressing my gratitude for all that has led me to this point, and stating my intentions for the year. I start every month with a general monthly outline, noting my current statistics for Instagram and YouTube, my main goals for the month, and any projects I need to work on. Throughout the month, I go back to this notebook and write out any ideas I may have, hash out details for projects and things I need to do, and journal so that I can work through my thoughts and feelings. Establishing this practice has been invaluable to me, and it helps me stay on track and keep up with how I progress throughout the year. For my 2019 planner, I got the new planner by Fran Nerd. I love last year so much, and I always love supporting Fran. The planner this year is perfect for my theme of accountability, since she specifically designed it for you to set goals and keep up with your progress throughout the year. I will link her video below where she shows the design in more detail, as well as a link to the planner itself. Since the planner is open dated, I like to fill out the monthly spread dates and then set my weekly spreads up for two weeks at a time. I check my planner almost daily, so as new things come up, I just add them in. Using my planner and notebook has made a huge difference in my organization and accountability, but it's also been great for my personal growth. Whatever your personal system is, I encourage you all to establish a way to keep track of your responsibilities and your progression. I like to just write everything down, but do whatever works best for you. A new addition this year is a monthly calendar that I'll be keeping at my desk. This was one of the Patreon perks for following FranNerd, and I'll be using it as a general overview for my month, just as an added measure to keep track of everything I need to do and remember. I also have this little whiteboard that I like to keep at my desk to note projects, to-dos, and any supplies I may need. The last thing I decided to do was refresh my inspiration board. Here I keep business cards from artists that I've purchased from, images that inspire me, some of my enamel pins, and images that directly relate to the goals that I've set for myself this year. I find doing this really helps with manifestation and feeds my motivation all throughout the year. I'm so excited to start working on my new goals and I'm ready to take on all of the challenges that may lie ahead of me. Starting everything fresh is a great way to kick off this new chapter and I hope to share my journey with each and every one of you. I hope you all had an amazing New Year's and I'm wishing you the best on your journeys throughout 2019. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.